Aaron Zephyr Hills, Gloria McKenzie's big win is the talk of the town. Everyone is trying to figure out if they know her. Here at Piccola Italia Restaurant, they think she might have come in to eat a few times. In fact, they think she sat right here at table number three. The mood at the restaurant is upbeat as the identity of the largest single lottery winner in history is finally revealed, 84-year-old Gloria McKenzie. The restaurant's owner, Antoinette Duramo, says she's never met Gloria personally, but she says they do have a mutual friend. She was a friend of mine. She knows her very well, and she told me she was here last week, one day last week. Diners say it's exciting to think a multimillionaire was in their midst, but some admit it's hard not to think about what could have been. I, I'm really happy for her, I, and uh, I and, uh, a little disappointed. There's a lot of people in the Zephyr Hills that are, are relations to the Rudemans and the Smiths, which are all my cousins. I was hoping it was one of them because they would have been my favorite cousin by then. Me too. <laughs> Gloria was staying in a tiny one bedroom duplex. Neighbors describe her as a sweet woman who often took walks outside. Happy day. Blessings. I'm beside myself. Back at the restaurant, diners are wondering what Gloria plans to do with all that cash. I'd share the love. I would. Everybody in Zephyr Hills would know me for sure. <laughs> Family members, everybody, yeah. They say Gloria's win goes to show you never know what life is going to dish out. People here don't know if they'll be seeing Gloria again, but they say that they certainly wish her the best of luck with whatever she decides to do. On scene in Zephyr Hills, Lori Davison, Bay News 9.